Hey, you are never too far gone. My name is Player Option, and welcome back to Wildlands. How do I stand up? A blizzard has struck while I was asleep. And uh, let's see, where do we leave off? We killed that bear amazingly, made ourselves bark armor, and we are getting flipping. We're probably gonna start freezing. I can't seem to light a fire because um, the obvious snow. Okay, now it ain't anything special, but it should be out of the snow and give us warmth quite temperate and this is not why are you not even we have like some rope hold on we can fix this there we go not bad at all we can't get very close to the fire can we i mean extremely hot all right so we're warm we're warm in the middle of a blizzard it gets us hot that's all we really needed to do um i i guess i could explore this a little bit i wish i could sleep a little bit more it's really annoying that i can't see anything oh that's right it's nighttime we'll sleep to morning there we go look at that sun come up what a beautiful morning. Where do we have any more cooked meat or what do we do with it all? Sure enough, we got three more roasted meat. Chalk on one of these, buddy. Fills you all the way up. Okay, so we slaughtered a bear. Let's see what else is on this island. Go for a little bit of an exploration run. All right, so these flax, these flax pants, they're super useful because they're how you can, we can make yarn with it. You know how we how we can make a boat? This is what we will we'll use it to make um, yarn, which we'll use to make cloth, which we'll use to make our sails. So that is very useful. Um, but this is a big island. Oh, oh rhino, oh rhino, oh rhino, oh rhino, oh rhino. Man, he is moving. Oh, he's chasing me. Oh, he's chasing me. <laughs> Time to go run away, Bambi. <laughs> and he got me. Man, that rhino was flipping moving. He came, he came after me like a flipping race car okay so i made some rhino bait we are actually gonna try and tame down this rhino so we basically we we place the bait and then we back up and we wait for him to go for it there 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 he's going for it so we're gonna come over to him and we're just gonna we're gonna tame by holding q it's all right buddy it's all right. i'm your friend i am friend who's a good boy we'll call you uh which says your woolly rhinoceros we'll call you a rhinoceros we'll call you rick rick the rhinoceros rick Dinosaurs. Oh, time to go, Rick! <laughs> Bear skin! <laughs> the interesting thing about these things that I was gonna do is we can ride them, obviously. Man, that bear is fast. Let's go! Time to go back to base. Boy, Rick, you have no problem going up any type of mountain and climb low or high. You can just put a haul up any of them. Ooh, what is that? What is that? I don't know what you are. Boy, there are these blue flowers everywhere. We can make as much cloth as we wanted. That is super useful. Super useful. So I actually have, you have a map in this game. This is kind of a rough idea of what, this is where I died. This is where I tamed the rhino. This is where I spawned it. And I don't know what this is. I didn't know this is probably right where that thing was floating in the sky, where, wherever it went. That thing, that's probably where the one is, isn't it? No, it's not. I don't know what that is. All right, regardless, the map's pretty big size. There is our little shack on the mountainside. It's not even really a shack, it's just a, I don't know what it is, an outhouse maybe? Good boy, Rick, you ran fast when that bear was attacking us. I don't know what my guy's doing, he like missed petting you, but that's right. Okay, so we still have more rhino bait, so we get to, well, you can take multiple animals at once, and I believe I can actually, if I push, and you can go to this and you can summon the animals, and if you tame more than one animal, you can call the one you want. So that is always super useful. But I don't know what we should do now, so I actually, no, I do. Maybe I should just work on going around like everywhere on the mountain, not just like, yeah, let's, do it. let's explore the rest of the island. That'll be that's what we're gonna do next. Alrighty, Rick, we got a little bit of a jog ahead of us, but that is all right. We're gonna go like a flipping missile. What is that? I think you're sick. Oh, here's a cave. Goodness gracious, would you screw off already? Man, it's fast. It's like keeping up with Rick. Another wolf? What is it with wolves in this game? They're everywhere on this island. There's more. Boy, this is a steep mountain, though. Okay, a thick or uh, a little bit of a fog seems to be setting here. That may be annoying for trying to find out where the perimeter of the islands are, but I don't think it'll be too bad. But this is just like an open plain area. This is kind of cool. Hello, friendly woolly rhino. He's not really fri friendly, is he? Come on, Rick. You could good night. I didn't think you could actually make it up that. That's pretty incredible. All right. Well, we have this island all but searched up. Also, another thing you can do is the map keep tracks where you keeps track of where you were, so you'll never get lost. Okay, well, let's set up some shop. Let's get ourselves a loom. Let's get ourselves a spinning wheel. Let's basically get ready so we can make an actual raft that goes a bit faster than that. Or not a raft, an actual boat that goes faster than the raft. Okay, and there is our lovely spinning wheel, which we should be able to make a ton of yarn with because we have a ton of that flax stuff. So that is going to be nice. And that is how we will turn it into cloth. Look at our little setup rolling right along. Oh my gosh, that rhino scared me. I forgot I forgot it was mine. <laughs> 
Okay, so we've got everything but the cloth. So we'll get this stuff crafted down, we'll make enough cloth, and then I probably should get another island ready to go, because basically I need iron, and I don't... So there is a mine. Basically, to progress the story and get myself... Not to progress the story, to get myself better equipment, the best thing for me is probably find iron. And I suppose I could check the mine before I leave this island. And with that being finished, that should give us the last piece of last piece of cloth we need to craft as soon as it's done. In 56 seconds, we will have enough to make a boat. Oh, we can make random food. We can make ourselves some French fr Let's make some popcorn. My guy is hungry. Ride as I'm cooking up some popcorn. I know we have meat, but we're gonna we're gonna make stuff. We're not just gonna always eat meat. We're gonna have some popcorn. I don't want this guy to get bored of what he's eating. Even though what he, he gets some very nice stuff. I mean, Black Bear, do you not have any idea how rare that is? Are you supposed to move? I don't think you've flinched since I put you here. And with that, we have got ourselves a brand new boat. Let's go take it to the water, set her down, and see how beautiful, see how gorgeous she is. And boom. Nice. All right, let's leave it here. I don't want to lose it or any do anything stupid. All right, my guy's hungry. Is the popcorn? Oh, it's ready. Give me that lum yummy popcorn. Num num, buddy. Tell me, is it good? Uh, he's not hungry anymore, so that's, that's good. Um, we didn't have any butter or salt, I doubt, unless maybe you were able to forge some out of the ocean somehow, which would be actually pretty impressive. But I also should probably be getting a house going. Probably cut down some trees and lay out a foundation for the house. I know, I'll probably wait till the next episode of that. I feel as we got a lot done this episode. Got a boat built, got our lovely little Rick, which we'll use greatly in this island. Um, we gotta explore the mine and probably get a house going because even if we carry on another island, we can always come back here. And if there's some valuable resource on this island, like the flax or something very important, it's good to have this island. Well, I'm gonna end this episode here. Thank you all so much for watching. Make sure if you have something you want me to play, you post it in the comments so I can take a look at it. But remember, love runs the world, so don't forget to run the world.